show you one. Oh, I know that now. At least yeah, just stay yeah. a little more longer. Come on now. I've tried. Don't worry. I'll come back very soon, okay? You so, keep saying that. No, I will. I'll come back very soon. Okay. You don't believe me? I believe you. <laughs> I'll come back very soon. I'm going to miss you. A silly roommate. A roommate that will totally forget about her friend when it comes to flexing. Come on. You know I just went over to help Chiki out for the weekend. I didn't go to flex. And you never bothered to call me. That was because... Because I am not important. That is the only explanation to it. Not so. No. I'm not important. If I were to be important, you would have called me. Yes. Anyways. How is Chiki? Hope he's fine. Huh. You haven't even asked me how my weekend went at his place. But you're asking me how is Chiki? Well, from what I can see, you are doing very good. You're looking even sharper than the way you left. <laughs> Are you in love with my brother? Please, the last I checked, I wasn't the one who went to spend the weekend with him. Yes. You're jealous. Me jealous? You're jealous! It's a lie, I'm not jealous. Okay, fine. Agreed that your brother is cute. Hmm? And uh -huh. most girls would do anything just to be with him. But I am not some kind of senseless girl that would do anything to be with just a random cute guy. <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness. So you're saying if he ask you out, you will say no? Mm, maybe. Maybe yes. Maybe no. Maybe yes. Maybe no. Okay, fine. He is cute. He is handsome. But mm -hmm. I am really not ready to put myself in that, you know, moment where I get myself in a relationship. Not after what I passed through with this nonsense <sighs> Okay, I understand, I understand. Ah, oh, God, I'm so hungry. Is there food in this house? Hungry? Oh, did you cook something? Did you not eat in Chike's house? I'm leave Chike's house. Did you cook something? I'm so hungry. Is there food? Yes, there is food. Oh. Go, go, go. Hey, I'm hungry. Oh, okay, ha, you I'm hungry. Hey! Thank you, Jesus, that we don't wear the same size in clothes. Food, who eats like this? Hmm. Babe, yes? Look at this. Look at this dress. Mm. This is so nice. And I'm going to use my photo shoot. It's oh so my god. Nice. Wow. Fine, yeah? Yes! How did you get this? I can't wait to rock it. Uh, someone is at the door. Are you expecting anyone? <laughs> no. Let me check. I'll be right back. Oh my god. Look who we have here. Hello. Where are you? Are you missing already? You can't see my house. Oh my god. Wait, wait, wait. Hey, wait. Hi. Hi. Tell me. Hi. Wait. Oh my god. 
Don't tell me your hair because of your perfume I took from your drawer. Wait. You stole my perfume from my drawer. I didn't steal it. I took it. Hey, God. Where is it? Quinette has it. Huh? Is it true? Um. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. You can keep it. It's not stealing. From me to you. So, because it's Queen it now, it's no longer still in Abby. It's a gift. No problem. It's fine. <laughs> what are you doing today? I want to take you out. Wow. Oh, I am so in the mood. At least I'm going to take that as an apology for calling me a thief. I wasn't talking to you. Huh? I'm inviting her. Huh? Do you mind? I want to take you to the mall. Um, no, I don't. Good. Just go inside and get into something better so we can go out. Okay. All right. Wait, 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 wait. Wait. I'm coming. There is no way I am not coming. I'm coming. I did not invite you. I don't care. I'm coming. She's the one I want to take out. I am coming. What kind of problem is this? I don't care. I'm coming. You guys will just go and leave me in this house. Come wait, on. You could relax. No, I am coming. I hope you had fun. Yes. Or go somewhere else? No, 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 no. I actually enjoyed my stay here. Thank you. I'm glad you did. You're uh, welcome. Yeah, and um, from the conversation we had there, I've been meaning to ask you, does it mean that your sister is the only committed woman in your life? <laughs> I don't know what you mean by committed, but um, my sister is about the only woman I have a close relationship with at the moment. And I want it that way for now. Oh, so you're saying that you are single? Yes, and not ready to mingle yet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, yeah. Fine. Fine. <laughs> so, shall we? Yes, please. You're rare. Quite strange. I, I mean, you're, 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 you're so different from other. About. What do you mean you are single and not ready to mingle? What sort of kindergarten line is that? Listen to me. So speak in clear terms, you have to speak in a child's tone. Beatrice. See, it's not like I really I'm really in a hurry to be in a relationship. Look. Don't take my brother seriously. He says things he doesn't mean. I don't understand. Are you trying to say your brother does not know what he wants? Not like he sounds though. Just that sometimes he's shy about expressing himself. <sighs> oh, come on, man. Come on. What? You need a wife and we both know that. I know. But I'm not in a hurry. <sighs> A man has told you in clear terms that he is not ready to be in a relationship and you are here between sitting down giving unnecessary defense. Why are you so pained? I mean, I thought you said you don't want my brother. Well, it's not like I'm really pained, you know. I'm not and nothing has changed. It's just that I feel humiliated. Humiliated? How? <sighs> Chicken. A girl asked you of your last date, and then boom, you're telling her you are hard to get. I did not lie to her, bros. <laughs> you owe her an apology, man. You do. An apology for what? The apology is not necessary, though. But you're hurting. Not like I'm. I'm really hurting. I'm not hurt. I just feel embarrassed, you know. I don't even know why I started having that conversation with him in the first place. You shouldn't. 
I am so sorry about that. You don't need to apologize, okay? Okay. Besides, if anyone has to apologize, not you. Hey, man, 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 leave it, leave it. Come here, man, come, come. I'm telling you, you need a wife. I don't need a drink. You need a wife. You're not getting any younger. Get yourself a wife, bro. I've heard you, sir. Thank you, my father. <laughs> bro, no. you're your wahala safe. No, on a serious note, I will when I'm ready for that. I'm just changing to something else. All right, then. You need something, you need right? You need it? No, I didn't. Um. <laughs> Okay, what is this? Did you bring me out here to start acting like a watered loaf of bread? <laughs> bread is food. Non living thing, it, it doesn't act. Your sister thinks you cannot express yourself. I guess she doesn't know you too well. <sighs> okay, I. I'm sorry if I said or did anything that hurt you. I'm deeply sorry I'm not like that. It's just... Those... You can't mingle with any random girl that goes shopping with you. <laughs> it is fine. You don't need to be sorry if you're sure. <laughs> so we're good? Good. I like good now. Good. Okay, good. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. This girl of yours is really becoming a, a topic of late. A bad one, I guess. Ah, uh, not really bad. Like, I haven't seen you pay attention to a girl before. Except your sister, of course. And it's been decades, so. I know, um, sorry, you care for more drink? Uh, no, no, I'm okay. I've had enough. I'll be seeing a client in 10 minutes' time. Hmm. <laughs> a client or a big guy. Hey. <laughs> Don't mind me. Look for me. Oh, okay, okay, bro. Um, so I'll call you when I'm done. Sure. Yeah, so check out. Have a nice day. Yeah. <sighs> I've told you that I'm very, 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 very sorry. What exactly do you want me to do for you so that you'll be happy? And what tell me? Uh, listen, please. I told you that this thing is over. It is over between us. What is your problem, eh? Leave me alone. Look, uh, Bonnet, that one is not possible. It's not possible. See, I travel this uh, mm. to make better money for me and you. Eh? Then go see Cambodia have been nice to me. I have better money, plenty of money, all cash, they give away. I don't care about your money. Do you understand me? Go and give your money to some broke girl out there. I don't need it. Tunet, shut up. Shut up your mouth, or say so. This is your big mouth, eh? You are trying to put it for trouble, eh? Please get off my phone, I beg. I need to do important things. Quinette? Yes? Get ready, let's go out. Get dressed. We are going out. Let's go see someone. We're going out? Yes. Dress hot and sexy. Very sexy. <laughs> hot and sexy. I'm just going to put on my gown. That's all. Who's that? Hang on. 
Tell me you were coming to my house with beautiful Queenette. Mm -hmm. Should we go back then? Go away. That's not what I meant. Come in. <laughs> <laughs> Come inside. <laughs> wow. Have a seat, please. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. You're welcome to my house. So, um, what do I offer you? Food. <laughs> you know I don't cook often. I did not cook today, Beatrice. I was meant to eat out before you came. Then fine, let's go. Okay, uh, fine. Uh, no, I am not hungry. You are. I am not. You are. I am not, Beatrice. Please, sis, can you just go into the kitchen and fix us something? Please. Okay. I will gladly do that. That's my sister! No. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you! <laughs> Sorry, don't mind us. We're like that sometimes. No, it's fine. Your house is actually beautiful. Oh, thank you. Uh, if you don't mind, I can change the channel. No, come on, it's fine. You sure? Yes. Why you need a woman in your life? There she goes again. You keep saying you don't want to mingle, you don't want to mingle. Do you want to get tangled? I said I was tired, I will tidy it now. You want to eat outside? Queen, let's, let's go out there. Have a uh -uh, Not like that. You know what? Both of you should just wait for me in the living room. I'll, I'll fix it and join you. No, no, no. Uh, well, I'll tell you myself. No, no, I won't have you go through that stress, don't worry. Come. I'll fix it. I insist, I said I will do it. I can clean it up. I'm sure you'll be back on. Beatrice, thank you. Beatrice, hey, how are you like this now? Whew. Hey, your food is ready. Oh, thank you. Whoa, well, already. Oh my god, this this looks lovely. You're welcome. 
Uh, aren't you eating? No, 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 no. I, I just made it for you alone. Remember I said earlier that I'm not hungry. Yeah, you did, but you can at least sit down and um, just with me. <laughs> no, thank you. I'm sorry, before you start eating, I'm pressed. Where is your visitor's toilet? Oh, there's one by this corner, but uh, it's faulty. I, I hope you don't mind using the one in my room. Oh, no. Okay, go ahead. Show me the one. Yeah, take the staircase, the first room on your right. All right, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. I didn't know you were going to come up seven minutes here. <laughs> so nice of you to help out. Thank you. It's okay. And you know, you really didn't have to knock for coming into your room. Yeah, but you don't walk into a woman without knocking. Oh, okay. I enjoyed your meal. You cook very nice. Thank you. My phone. I I forgot it. Okay, I I'll be downstairs. Thank you very much. back this late is anything wrong i don't understand why would you have wanted me to sleep there are four empty rooms in that house you could have passed the night in one of them instead of risking your life and coming back this late well your brother brought me back and oh, beatrice you. let me even ask you why would you take me to your brother's house just to abandon me there i don't understand it and besides, me, yeah, I have this feeling that you see this whole drama is a setup, not so. Oh, please, go and clean up your makeup. Let's have this talk tomorrow, okay? <laughs> I should go and clean up my makeup while you slept with yours. No, Beatrice, we are having this talk now, like right now. Please, let's have this talk tomorrow. We're having it now, like right now. We're having this stuff right now. The phone is ringing. Hi. 
Hello, good evening. Hey, I'm home. Oh, thank God. And uh, thank you for bringing me back home. You're welcome. And thank you so much for the assistance. I mean, I really appreciate it. Good night, Chiki. <laughs> good night, Angel. Oh, hello, Chiki. Please, my name is not Angel. My name is Quinette. Okay. Good night, Quinette. Good night. Weird. <sighs> so does she have an Instagram account? Yeah, she does. That's sweet, huh? Um, I guess so. Bring out your mind from the gutters, honestly. We didn't do anything. I, I was just surprised. Why do I feel there's more to that story? What? <laughs> Everyone will not be you, bro. <laughs> Please get out of our phone. Okay, we'll talk tomorrow. All right, good night. <laughs> Yes, good morning. We're at your door. I am Quinet. Which door? Your door, yeah. Oh my god. Okay, hang on, I'm coming. Whoa. Even you? Let's go, John. Hey, why not? Why not? Why not? Ow! Okay, then okay, give me some time. Let me get this. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Hey, Let's go. Really? Uh -huh. But we just got here. What? We've been at this since morning. God, I'm so tired. Let's go. I, I want us to jog a little more longer, please. Yes. Okay. Then I'll go there. You guys should just take care of them. Okay, then. See you when we're back. Take care of yourself. All right. Okay. Hi. What is that? I think it's a drop of sweat. Okay. <clears throat> You're better now, right? Yeah, better. Okay, so should we continue jogging or we just go home? Um, let's let's jog for a little longer. All right, fine. Um, let's let me. Let's... Oh, here. Okay. okay, thank you. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 
When did you get back? Um, not long ago. Okay. Um, Beatrice. Your brother asked me out, and I said yes. Whoa! <laughs> you said yes? <laughs> Are you happy for me, or you're just pretending? I'm just... I'm amazed because you said yes without, without asking you for permission. Or giving a second thought. Is it a good or a bad thing? It's a good thing. But you know, you don't know him too well yet. Yes. But I'll get to know him while we date. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Beatrice. What? Are you really happy? I am. You know, I've always wanted this, you know. So I'm happy. Really? Uh-huh. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. When love is for real, for real, for real, it's always true and fresh. much trouble on the spot, so much harder, there is to jump, I have seen the better side of life, cause you gave me so much hope, make me no fool, you are the brightest star I've ever seen, you are the comfort of the sick, the angel of my being. Never stop my love for you. Okay, there we go. Alright, thank you. Hold me down to your heart and cut me no fear. Wow. Yeah. That's some good news, man. Yes. Thank you. Don't you think you're going too fast with this? How do you mean? Like, you just met this girl not quite long ago. You asked her out on a date to which she said yes without stress. And now you're asking her to marry you. To which she has said yes without stress again. You're really cool with this, aren't you? Joshua, what's the problem? I mean, you're supposed to be my best friend. If there's anybody who should support me all the way, it is you. Where is this coming from? What's going on, Joshua? Hey! Hi, baby. She's here. Hi, baby. How are you? I'm good. Mm -hmm. How is it being? Beautiful. I can see. Ah, I'm sorry. Uh, okay. Oh. <laughs> um, meet Joshua. Joshua is my legal advisor. Joshua, my wife. Hi, good afternoon. Hi, good afternoon. Okay. Wow. You're really beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I see where the rush is coming from. Get away. <laughs> <laughs> um, babe, the rush. Oh, don't mind him. That's how he talks. This guy's a clown. <laughs> Come. <laughs> oh, yeah. So, how's it been? Good morning. 
Good morning. How was your night? It was beautiful. Baby. Yes, ma'am. Where are you dressed to? Um, there's an emergency at the office, so I just want to rush. But baby, you're on leave. I know, but since I'm around, it's a matter of life and death. I won't leave someone to die, right? Thank you, my love. I'll see you soon. Okay. Right, take care of yourself. I will. <laughs> Everything is so fine. I don't even fancy anyone. I don't know. I feel he didn't do a great job. No, he did. Okay, look at this one. This is so nice. I think you should enlarge this one. No, no, no. Not this one. Really? I, li I like the other one. This one? Yeah, this is nice too, but this is also nice. The same thing my husband said. I don't know. He, he likes this. He too must have the same taste. Bloody sicker than water. Oh my god. Wow. I can't believe we're officially in-laws. Like, <laughs> I am so happy. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I'm so, so happy. Okay. You know, uh, when the clock ticks, time changes. Okay. Well, I'll be going back to Abuja tomorrow. And I'll be staying a while to just take care of yourself and take care of my brother. You know, he's my only brother. And I do not joke with him. Please. Oh, Beatrice, I'm going to miss you. And I'll miss you too. Like, I really meant it when and I said... And I'll really miss you too. I swear. Come on, give me a hug. Come here. You can yourself. Come on. Okay. I promise. I'll get you from Abuja. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. About the photo? Well...
no cinto. Where are you coming from? Are you deaf or you are dumb? I asked, where are you coming from? Easy, babe. Easy what? You left this house 9 a.m. this morning, coming back home by this time, and you're here telling me, easy, babe. I am sorry I'm coming back this late. Oh, save that nonsense you want to spill this minute. Hold your ears. What's going on? Why are you acting weird? And God save you if you do not hold your ears this minute because you will not like them next to me. Hold your ears, Mr. Man. <laughs> Let this be the first and the last time you would leave me alone in this house to return this lead. If it happens again, I'll be gone before you return. I'm sorry. Ooh. I should be asking you that. So you're trying to tell me that the woman you married newly into your house told you to pull on your ears like some kid, and you actually did. Joshua, this is serious. Listen, you needed to see her face in that moment. For some seconds, I was I was scared. I mean, I hadn't seen her like that before, and it, it wasn't funny. Ah, it's nothing. It's nothing. Ah, come on, man. It's nothing. It's no big deal. Listen. Um, uh, some girls, when they fall in love with a guy, it's hard for them to stay 30 minutes without the guy. So it's nothing, it's no big deal. You think it's nothing? You, you think Asana would beat my you in this? No. Babe, how are you? I'm doing okay. Ah, our wife. Uh-uh, Mr. Barrister. With all due respect, don't you ever Address me as our wife again. Do you understand it? I am not your wife. Mrs. Chiki, please. Sorry. Mrs. Chiki. Absolutely. I, uh, bye, Chiki. I have to go now. So soon? Yeah, I just remembered I have a meeting to attend to. Yeah, yeah, I'll see you guys. Just... Okay, okay, then let me see. Okay. What was that for? I don't understand. What was what for? No! What were you discussing with your friend? Let me guess. I politely complained about my husband coming home late. And voila, he invited his legal advisor to the house to complain. Not so. Babe, what is wrong with you? Why are you making up issues? Oh, excuse me. You think I am mad? Really? You invited your friend to the house to complain or judge my character? Is that what you're doing? And here you are standing saying that I'm complaining. Queenet. I'm not going to have this conversation with you. Oh, no, you wouldn't dare. Do you understand? It is no longer babe. It is now Queenette, right? You don't ever, like, ever walk out on me again. Do you understand me? I know men like you, and I know how to deal with them. <laughs> Thank you. 
marriage is like a vehicle. It will only start if you start it. It will only move if you put the gear to drive. And when it moves, it becomes a duty to control the steering to the path to go. Because your life depends on it. But Adani, what if this steering is stiff from the onset? Grease it with oil. It will become flexible to control. Go home to your wife and find the negative signs. You argue too much. You argue too much. And you seem to value this your relationship with the barrister to this marriage. Do you know that's not true? You see? You are arguing again. You are arguing with me again. Every time you argue. In everything you must argue. I don't understand it. And this is one thing I hate in people. Eh? Especially you guys. If I had seen this trait in you, I wouldn't have said yes to this marriage. At all. Mm -hmm. And you see this marriage thing? It is not working at all. Listen, my angel, my beautiful one. I am begging you, this is the two of us. We can make this marriage work. Let's try, please. Why? Because I love you. I love you from the bottom of my heart. See, if there's anything I'm doing that you're not cool with, just let me know and I'll adjust. I love you too. I love you so much. You are my world. I love you more and you know it. Please, I just need you to stay with me. You know, be there for me whenever I need you. Okay, fine. First thing tomorrow morning, I will go to the office and tender my resignation to the admin. And then I can be with you anytime. Why? I, yeah. I don't understand it. If you do that, then who will foot the bills? You just... No, no. I'm asking. Who is going to foot the bills? Who will do... There's no time I eat your food that I don't feel fulfilled. Mm -hmm. Just have a taste of this wonderful delicacy. Mm. How is it? Mm. <laughs> Majesty. There we go. to CHOO. Um, hold on. Chief Healthcare Operational Officer. Officer, yes. Are you serious? I'm so happy for you. Wow, yeah. show me. Let's take a look. I got to the office today and I saw this. Okay. This is true. Make <laughs> <laughs> him so happy for us. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> hey, my 
my legal advisor. <laughs> yes, I, I was calling you to give you the good news. I've been promoted to CHO. I'm serious. <laughs> I'm home. Very necessary. <laughs> What is it again, baby? <laughs> Hold on a second. So, if Joshua had picked your call, he would be the first to know about this. No, now. I only informed him on my way to the house. No, clearly. You are saying that Joshua comes first before me, not so. Why, why are you taking this this way? Oh, yeah. Baby, I'm sorry. Baby, I didn't mean that. I swear, I didn't mean it. Baby, I'm sorry. Baby, please. Hi. Baby, I'm sorry, baby. Baby, please. Baby. Baby, baby, I am sorry. Please, please forgive me. Baby, look at my face. Slap me, please. You can slap me. Baby, please stop crying for me, please. I am not crying for you. I will never cry for you.
Mm-hmm. Hello, dear. Please come and open the door for me. I need to sleep. <laughs> if sleep was important to you, you would have returned home earlier. Who are you to dictate to me when to come back to my own house? I am your wife. I am your wife and you paid my bride price. Which means that everything including you belongs to me. Honey, please come and open the door for me. It's raining and I'm cold out here. Why is your voice low all of a sudden? Why are you speaking in a low tone? I thought you were shouting before. Go back to those your stupid friends who advised you to stay home late, come back to the house and shout at your wife. Honey, please come. I'm, I'm cold. I, okay, get, get me. Hello? <coughs> Hello? Chike? Hello? Thank you, doctor, for coming once again. But you haven't told me what exactly happened to him. He was exposed to cold. And a person who's an asthmatic exposing himself to cold can complicate his health status. Well, um, don't worry, he'll be fine. Yeah? Just tell him to see him immediately he looks up. Uh, no problem, I'll tell that chief. One more thing, the air conditioning room should always be off. Make sure. I'll make sure the air conditions are off always. Thank you very much. You have lots of explaining to do. No, your friend has the explanations to do. Why didn't you tell me about your health status? Mm? So we're now keeping things from each other, not so. You cannot talk. So you cannot open your mouth and speak to me right now. Mm? Are you implying that you lying down there is my fault? That I am the cause of this problem? Is that what you're trying to say? Chike, we are settling this once and for all. That is it. Babe. And why did you not tell me about this? It was contained. I didn't think it was necessary. You did not think it was necessary to tell your wife something as serious as asthma? Did you know the trauma I, ha I felt yesterday? What if something had happened to you? Nothing would happen to me. I just caught cold. And it's my fault, right? I knew it. I knew it, it's my fault. I'm such a bad wife. Baby, I am sorry. Please, please, you just have to forgive me. I love you so much. I don't know what I will be doing in this world without you. Baby, I am so sorry, please. I'm hungry. Okay. 
What would you eat? I'll go make anything you want. Anything warm with less oil. All right. I got it. I will go, okay? I'll be back. Your wife needs help. I know Adani, but I don't know how to help her. Let's start with booking a counseling session for her. Counseling session? Do you think that will work? Let's give it a try at her convenience. Okay, if you say so, I will give it a try. Thank you so much. I'll be on my way now. No problem. I'll give you a call later. No problem. Thank you. God be with you. God be with you. Bye bye. Joel from KUP Fans. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. Sir. You're highly anticipated. Please come inside. man heavily to be here. The least you could do was cooperate with him. What? Someone who almost raped me right in front of you and you're here standing telling me that I should have cooperated with him. You need help. And for God's sake, I'm doing everything possible to assist you with that. Why don't you just cooperate? Ah!
Babe, I want to understand what you mean by the words you said downstairs. Which of them? <laughs> the one you said that uh, I need help and you're trying to assist. And I, 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 like, are you trying to say that I am not normal? Isn't it obvious you're not normal? What sort of human behaves like you do? This minute you're so sweet and loving and adorable, the next minute you switch into something else and become so vile like a witch. Like so. I am a what? I am a what? Are you trying to say? Are you trying to say? Are you trying Baby. Baby, I am sorry. Please. Baby, I... Baby, I, I got these medications for you. They will help you. They will, they will help relieve the pains you're feeling. Please, you need to take these medications to help. I am sorry. Please. Please. Baby, please stop closing your eyes now. Please. Don't you think you're going too fast with this? How do you mean? Like, you just met this girl not quite long ago. You asked her out on a date to which she said yes without stress. And now you're asking her to marry you. To which she has said yes without stress again. You're really cool with this, aren't you? Joshua, what's the problem? I mean, you're supposed to be my best friend. If there's anybody who should support me all the way, it is you. Where is this coming from? May the peace of the Lord be with you. Amen. I wasn't expecting to see you. That's the clear difference between the believer and the unbeliever. Is that why you're here? You sent for me. you thus much why not stop I try I want to stop but I can't this emotion this emotion has consumed me 
Do you truly love him? I love my husband. With every fiber in me, I love my husband. I do. And if you hit him? <laughs> when I do that, I feel dead. I feel like I'm choking. I feel like... I don't know how I feel. But I feel terrible. I don't feel good at all. It's not a good feeling. I feel like I've committed the worst sin on earth. Make peace with yourself before it's too late. I need help. 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 What is happening to me? What is all this? How do I help myself? <laughs> I need help. I need help. I know I need help, but where would the help come from? This is not happening. Going to the hospital. Hold your ears. What's going on? Why are you acting weird? And God save you if you do not hold your ears this minute because you will not like the next thing. Hold your ears, Mr. Man. <laughs> <She make it. laughs> Let this be the first and the last time you will leave me alone in this house to return this late. If it happens again, I'll be gone before you return. No, 
Clearly, you are saying that Joshua comes first before me, not so. Why, why are you taking this this way? They have to solve my conscience now, so I'll survive. As a journey along, I pray things follow right. As I play this day, God wash me once again. Baby? Baby? Where could this guy have gone without telling me, eh? Chike, you're provoking me. I don't know why you like making me angry. Why now? Switched off. 
Have you tried reaching out to his sister? I have. I have tried reaching out to her, but she keeps screaming over the phone, shouting, screaming at me, and I can't make sense of what she's saying. I guess you have to go to the police station to make a statement. Police? To make a statement? Joshua, that sounds like I'm in a deep mess now, please. Well, the police might have to detain you just to investigate the case. Just to make sure you don't have a hand in your husband's disappearance. I don't have a hand in his disappearance, I swear. I don't have a hand in his disappearance. Joshua, you have to help me. I don't want to go to jail, please. It's not my job to decide that, okay? The court will decide if you go to jail or not. And they will also decide how long you stay there. Now, my job is to present the case in court. And that would be a case of constant abuse and assault against my client. And of course, to also tender my video evidence. Did you, did you just say video evidence? Oh yeah. At the house, it's CCTV wired. How did I not know that there was a CCTV camera in this house? No, don't be too hard on yourself. You wouldn't know about it. I actually put him up to this. You know, he wouldn't press charges against you. And even if he wanted to, there would be no evidence for that. And this, see him in court. Joshua, please. Please. Joshua, please, I beg you. I am begging you with everything you hold secret. I don't want to go to jail. I beg you, please. You need to save me, please. I am a good girl. Hey, hey, hey. See you in court, Queen Please don't do this. Joshua, please, please, please don't do this. Oh, hold on, hold on. Are you trying to assault me too? No. It's your recording. <laughs> Please don't do this, Joshua. Please, please. Joshua, please, I'm a good girl. I beg you, please. I am sorry. I came back home from work a long time ago and I, I could not find your brother. I have searched everywhere. I even called his phone numbers. They are all switched off. I don't know where he has gone to. Please, Beatrice, I beg you. If you know where your brother has gone to, take me to him. Please. I know I have not been a good wife to him, but I have changed. I am a good girl now. I, I beg you, please. Beatrice, I am desperate. I need to see your brother, please. Beatrice, please, please, please. I need to see you. At least let me pick my things. Please, I'm a woman like you. I'm pregnant for your brother. Beatrice, please. If you know where your brother is, I beg you take me to him. Please, I am sure he will be happy to share this good news with me. I beg you. Please, leave. I want to close the gate.
I grew up seeing my mother suffer domestic violence in the hands of my father. I watched him hit her at will. He verbally abused her. And I finally watched my mother die helplessly because of the injuries she incurred from my father's brutality. It made me mad. It made me raged. And from that day, I vowed that no man will ever do that to me. I vowed to take revenge for my mother. All I wanted was for Chike to respect me, to love me, never to trade in the part of my father. I wanted a happy, peaceful home. But I guess I got it all wrong. This heat wave is just, just consumed me. If I ever have a second chance, God's willing, I'll make things right. Good wishes never comes to manifestation. But I pray this does, because I really need this second chance. <laughs>